Hi, today we are going to learn about describing turns. A turn means to rotate or move a thing around a center point. There are two ways of indicating a turn. First one is clockwise, whereas second one is anti-clockwise. Clockwise It is the direction in which the hands of a clock move. Anti-clockwise This is the opposite direction to the direction in which the hands of the clock move. Let's learn about different type of turns. First one is whole turn. A whole turn means a complete round. When we start from a point and take a full round turn, it is called a whole turn. Next is half turn. Half turn means a turn in opposite direction. For example, if something is facing north, the half turn will be the opposite of it that is south. We can take half turn clockwise and anti-clockwise. As you can see this here, if this is the starting position of the frog, so after taking half turn in clockwise or anti-clockwise direction, we'll get the frog in these positions. Next is a quarter turn. A quarter turn is the half of a half turn. Quarter turn will be from north to east or turning clockwise. And in an anti-clockwise direction, the quarter turn will be from north to west. Here is one example. As you can see this here, if this is the starting position of the smiley, then these will be the respective positions after its clockwise turn and anti-clockwise turn. Next is three-quarter turn. A quarter turn thrice makes a three-quarter turn. For example, if we take a three-quarter turn clockwise from north, it will be west. And if we take a three-quarter turn anti-clockwise from north, it will be east. Here is another example. So if this is the starting position of the penguin, then these will be the respective positions of the penguins after taking the clockwise turn and anti-clockwise turn. Let us solve a question here. So the lollipop has turned. So is it quarter turn clockwise? Is it three quarter turn clockwise? Or is it half turn clockwise? Now by looking at this figure, we can see that the lollipop has turned three quarter turns clockwise, hence option 2 is correct.